Saint of the Day. Today we celebrate the feast of Saint Theophanes, March 12th. Saint Theophanes grew up under the guardianship of Emperor Constantine V, his father having died early, leaving him heir to a large estate. He was induced to marry the daughter of a Byzantine patrician, but the marriage remaining unconsummated by mutual consent, he joined the monks of Polychronicon while his wife became a nun. He then founded monasteries and served as abbot at Mount Sigriana on the shores of the Sea of Marmara between Cyzicus and the Kirmasti River. In 787 AD, he was invited to take part in the Second Council of Nicaea in Turkey, which sanctioned the use and reverence of sacred images. But in 1814, the Armenian Emperor Leo V reversed this policy and strove to suppress the cult of images. Theophanes ranged himself against Leo's iconoclastic policy and paid no heed to his threat. Thus, after receiving 300 stripes, he was thrown into a dungeon for two years. Deprived of the bare necessities of life, he fell severely ill and was exiled to the island of Somothres in Greece, where he died on 12 March 1817. He is venerated as a saint both by the Greek and the Latin Rite churches. He was the author of an important chronicle composed between 1810 and 1814 at the suggestion of his friend George Sincellus. It covers the period between 284 and 813 AD. His chronicle, along with that of Nicephorus I, Patriarch of Constantinople, highlights the principal Byzantine historical source for the 7th and 8th centuries. A reflection Saint Vincent Pallotti says, Not the goods of the world, but God. Not riches, but God. Not distinction, but God. Not advancement, but God. God always in everything. Amen. Saint Theophanes, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. To all the listeners, have a blessed and meaningful Lenten season. May the blessing and grace of Jesus Christ be upon you and your family members. Amen.